Hey, what's going on guys? So in today's video, you can tell from the title that we are finally putting a new exhaust up on this truck. I say finally because I've been wanting to do it for a while. I finally went and bought one. Uh, it was a little bit pricey, but I'll show you here. It is 100% worth it. Today, we're gonna see if it affects any like sound, if it does any popping, stuff like that. Yeah, so let's go and check it out here. So here, you have it in the box. And today I'm gonna to go ahead and actually ceramic coat it too, because it is a beautiful tip. Um, so yeah, Weston Automotive makes these tips in as you can tell from the thumbnail, like I said, you have probably seen these tips before. So if any of you guys know exhaust, you know that this is basically just an exact replica of the Corsa exhaust tips. Now I'm not a huge fan of Corsa. I feel like you kind of get the same noise from just a straight pipe in my opinion, but I have always loved their tips. I'm not gonna spend almost two grand for a tip. However, um, I went on Amazon. I'll put the link in the description below for this guy. This was like a buck 25, so I can see why they're expensive. Like I said, this tip is absolutely beautiful. I've been wanting it so bad, and I just, I've always loved like the kind of, the close dual out, and then like the slant that matches with the body line. So yeah, I think it's perfect. I'm also going to go ahead and ceramic coat this thing just to make sure it's fully protected uh, from all the elements to keep like the nice pretty shine. So we'll hit it with ceramic coating, and then uh, yeah, we should be all good to go. So let's go ahead and jump into this. Again, it is so good to have something to work in. I finally freaking caved in and bought one of these. I mean, I've, I've been needing it. I really have. Like, I really have been wanting it and needing it. Um, so, finally got ourselves a little jack, a little Harbor Freight special. You know, nothing wrong with that. But anyway, back to what we're doing. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and get started on this. Nothing wrong with this with this exhaust tip. I really haven't had any problems with it. I've thoroughly enjoyed it, so I'm not really wanting to do this so much because I don't like it, but just because I want to try something new. So that's what we're doing. All right, you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and get this truck jacked up, which I finally can do with that old boy down there. But I'm actually gonna go ahead and get that thing put together so I can use it here. Alrighty, we got the old one off. And we're gonna try to get this new one on here. You see the tip looks good right there. We got that that big old gap in there so that's our only problem right now hey what's going on guys so i'm actually trying to figure this out here like i said the bend is not big enough to hold the exhaust pipe so what i did is i actually ordered a another three inch pipe with a 45 degree bend in it and i'm gonna see if i can cut off a little more actually so my idea is you can see right here where the exhaust goes from that bend back to the original three inch size you can see it bulge out so I'm actually thinking about cutting it back a little more to stick my little bend in here. And then uh, that should be able to have the exhaustive level right here. All right, you guys, I got everything I need for this project now. Um, so basically I don't have another one of these clips right here. So I went ahead and just bought one from uh, O'Reilly's. So I got a little three inch clip clamp right there. Uh, we had a problem with this guy. So this piece, the three ID, so the inside diameter of this pipe right here is a little bit too small for the uh, that, that pipe right there, as you probably saw. And uh, so what I went did is, you can actually rent these like uh, expanders out. The so same, same, you just go to O'Reilly's or whatever. Uh, I rented this one out. It's a three fourths right here. So I'm gonna put it on here. I don't have an impact and I'm just gonna like freaking strong arm this thing and see if I can expand this as much as I need to, but yeah, that's basically all I got, all I need to do. And uh, I'm actually gonna go ahead and do some sound comparisons. We're gonna do just the pipe versus the pipe with the tip. So it's actually a pretty big difference I was doing it earlier. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. All right guys, so we finally have found the perfect spot to put it. So basically I went ahead and cut off like nothing like a little quarter inch, I think it was. Let me see here. Yeah, so we cut about that much more off. Um, it was actually perfect. If you look up here, you can see just how close it was. 
and it's close. So, but it's good. Um, it's all tightened down. Everything's good to go there. And then we went ahead and cut off probably like half an inch of this guy. Um, and I'm not going to show you with a tip on because that'll ruin the surprise. But yeah, it, it's ready to be mounted on. We cut this much off. So, however that much is right there. Like I said, probably like a, probably like a half inch, something like that. Maybe lick a little more. That's all good to go now. So like I said, now we're gonna go ahead and uh, and get the uh, expander again and do what I can. There's a few times where I would go to expand the pipe and it would still kind of wiggle a little bit So I just kept having to maneuver the expander in there and just crank wherever I could because it I don't know if it was doing the whole thing at once I felt like it was kind of just hitting certain points. But yeah, it's it's finally on there Dude, I was cranking that thing <laughs> Like, If you if you don't have an impact you better be freaking like stellar and pulling <laughs> Yeah, she's on there uh, it looks it looks really good. I haven't even turned the truck on yet, so I'm excited to see how it sounds I'm loving the way that it looks right now because I'm looking right at it So I'm gonna go ahead and clean up here I'm go inside. I'm tired as hell. I did legs and I basically did pull today. So <laughs> All right, I'm gonna catch up with you guys tomorrow. So enjoy these after shots this thing holy crap y'all see that you just hear that all right now we're gonna go ahead and do our comparison so here's a little bit of this guy right here
All right, guys, that's going to wrap it up for this video. Really hope you enjoyed this one. I most definitely did. It was a huge headache, honestly. Like, I mean, I, I did not expect the freaking, the piping issue to happen. I thought it was just going to be like a straight little cut and then like right on there. But it is what it is. I think it's amazing, as you can tell from the sound. It just sounds so beefy. And this thing pops, too. Oh, my gosh. Like, it's, I don't know. It just sounds so good. But... Yeah, look how, look how beautiful this is right now, y'all. See this? Got a little construction going on over there. But we got the sunset. We got old clean Sierra here. I just spent like past four hours giving her like a deep bath. I mean, we're talking inside and out, son. So she looks amazing. Fog lights are fantastic. Oh, let me go cut them bad boys on. Hold on. Yeah, fog lights look amazing. Look at this. Look at this right here, boy. Oh my gosh. Y'all see that right there? I'm taking a picture though, hold up. Yeah, this looks fantastic. Uh, I love the way it sounds. Um, yeah, it's been so good. And like I said before, I really, it kind of came out perfect because I was going to be a little concerned that it's not like parallel with this thing right here. But I mean, honestly, you want it to stick out. And it's kind of cool that like that looks new in there as well, you know? So like from the back, you have like a normal like pipe now. See some like back here, looks like a new pipe. See what I'm saying? Looks brand new. So yeah, looks great, I love it. Um, like I said, I'll put that in the description below. If you want to get it, you can. But um, as always guys, thank you so much for the support. As you can see, we're finally kind of get back into it. So after I got this little garage going on here, projects are just starting to come in. So yeah i'm super excited i as you know me i love working on this thing and i saw this one tiktok where it was like hey man i thought you're poor he's like you just suck being poor you have to take old stuff and make it new stuff so that's that's pretty much what we're doing with this old girl here because uh, i'll put a picture like this is her before you know like when i first picked her up and then till now you know so it's it's been a big difference you know yeah expect more changes to come expect more content and uh as always guys thanks for watching like subscribe do whatever you want to do it is your choice and uh i'll see you later peace out guys